Ida B. Wells was a black journalist, educator, and early leader in the civil rights movement. She was one of the founders of the NAACP. She dedicated a lifetime to combating prejudice and violence, and the fight for racial equality, especially that of black women. She was born into slavery, but was freed by the Emancipation Proclamation during the American Civil War. She lost both her parents and her brother at a young age during the yellow fever pandemic. She later became a teacher and wrote for the local newspaper in Memphis, covering incidences of racial segregation. In the 1890s, Wells documented and exposed lynching as a barbaric practice by whites in the South. A white mob later destroyed her newspaper office. Her investigative reporting was then carried nationally in a black-owned newspapers only. She later settled and married in Chicago and had a family while continuing her work writing, speaking, and organizing for civil rights, and later for women's suffrage. Ida B. Wells was well-spoken regarding her beliefs as a black female activist but faced regular public disapproval by white women suffragists. During the Spanish-American War, in the Philippine-American War, an anti-imperialist league was formed to fight U.S. annexation of the Philippines, citing a variety of reasons ranging from economic to racial and moral. Ida B. Wells was part of this league and was obviously outspoken against these wars. Wells continues to be a role model for both black activists and feminists to this day, as well as aspiring journalists who continue to fight for human rights and expose systemic racial cover-ups and other social injustices. Let me know other fascinating facts about this person in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. See you on the next video.